I first originated this and developed this composition primarily from a perspective of taking care of any pathology that exists on the dermis and the epith you know if we're talking about the external portion of the skin uh, the epithelial portions and uh, the epidermis and um, the dermis and as an integrated practitioner and involved in biochemistry I designed a process that basically is revolved around something called tropocollagen. Tropocollagen is essentially the basic makeup on how 28 different types of collagen within our body is developed. By providing the substrates of tropocollagen and introducing something we call hydroxylation, which is just merely a, su a summary of saying that it's the process that catalyzes the response. It's kind of like putting a cake in an oven. The oven is the hydroxylation process because it heats it up. We were able to design, or I was able to design a process with very promising results. And this process delivers the tropocollagen mechanism within the skin when applied topically. So, why is this important? Number one, it's not the just diminishes wrinkles and lines is tested and seen by Estee Lauder, which this was trialed by. But number two, it has a great advantage in promising uh, uh, conditions of potentially helping things like solar keratosis, actinic keratosis, which are precancerous lesions within, on, within the skin or within the skin. Number one, number two is diminishing hyperpigmentation we call it uh, melasma. And number three, addressing something called telangiectasia, which are the dilated capillaries that we oftentimes see on people's faces, particularly alcoholics or people indulged in alcohol. So we have two formulas here. One uses a hydroxylation process as a vitamin C, which vitamin C is hydroxylation process. That's why it's so important for us to some degree as a vitamin. And Number two is alpha ketoglutaric acid or glutaric acid. A, it's basically abbreviated uh, as AKG. And AKG is a hydroxylation as well. But the difference is it doesn't amber. So with vitamin C, people are aware that vitamin C will amber over a period of time. And this has to do with how ascorbic acid receives oxygen. Uh, it's harmless. It's just some people don't want to look like they've been in the sun or tanned. So we have two processes here. One with AKG as an example, it's a hydroxylation process, and the other is with vitamin C or ascorbic acid. We lower the browning or the ambering of the vitamin C component by using a sodium ascorbate, which lowers that process. So for those of you who wish to use something that has been shown to be valuable in reducing cosmetically wrinkles uh, or those who wish to keep and maintain health of the skin, we strongly encourage you to use this process. Be sure to visit mehanformulations.com to check out all of the other items in the BioFactor X line.